This, if you're a fan like me, you'll agree that our house is among the best sitcoms ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Bernard Breslau played the character William Singer in the sitcom when he was 27 in 1961. Sadly, on June 11, 1993, he left us due to a sudden heart attack at 59 in Park Regan, London, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. No, his wife is. Trouble was, when she told him, he collapsed and he's been here ever since. Don't let them tell you having one is easy. On a totally closed set <laughs> And Jenny said, what do you mean? To a closed set. He said, we're on location in <laughs> Chobham Common. <laughs> so he said, we can't. Trader Faulkner played the character Stephen Hatton in the sitcom when he was 33 years old in 1960. Sadly, on April 14, 2021, he left us due to brain cancer at 93 in London, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Really be answered. That's one of the first rules of successful portrait painting. But it might be somebody important. Oh, I don't know anybody important except... 55 Stratford. Larry was going to be absolutely wonderful. And John Gielgud, who was directing, said, Oh, Larry, Larry, please tell Larry, that's so vulgar. The Derek Eiler played the character Mr. Parks in the sitcom when he was 46 in 1960. Sadly, on October 7, 1999, he left us due to natural causes at 85 in Ash Grove, Queensland, Australia. We're deeply saddened by his passing. I used a running chain stitch, you know. Really? Mm. Mm, much more decorative. Is that so? Mm. Yeah. I don't know. I, I just don't seem to be able to handle it. I can go up to fifty pounds whenever I like. Check my balance. Order statements. Let's walk. It's a lovely day. Fresh air. Oh, nonsense. Champagne. Hattie Jackass played the character Georgina Ruddy in the sitcom when she was 38 in 1960. Sadly, on October 6, 1980, she left us of heart attack at 58 in Kensington, London, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. You know, dear, how nice. Simon, I'm awfully sorry to trouble you at work, dear, but there's something I must talk to you about. I wonder if you'd heard anything about it as a counsel. Well... I hardly like bothering you at all, but Cynthia seems so lethargic this morning, so naturally I put her to bed. But I thought possibly there was some little tonic you could recommend. Well, yes. Now I don't... Norman Rossington played the character Gordon Brandt in the sitcom when he was 32 in 1960. Sadly, on May 21st, 1999, he left us due to cancer at 70 years old in Manchester, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. <laughs> hello. Oh, hello, Mike. Yes, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. Fine. Yeah? Hey, great! Sure. Lady. <laughs> she used to be a big fat lady. I loved her being a big fat lady. Well, maybe not. Charles Hawtrey played the character Simon Willow in the sitcom when he was 46 in 1960. Sadly, on October 27, 1988, he left us due to cardiovascular disease at 73 in Deal, Kent, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. Hold up. What the heck did I plant? <laughs> Are you cold? Rubber. I don't need your advice. <laughs> oh, silly devil. <laughs> Tell you what about I planted. Rubber. When you, how did the, the Carry On film series come, come about in the first place? I think uh, everyone would be interested in that. Right. Uh, well, you know we worked for um, a bread... John Sims played the character Daisy Burke in the sitcom when she was 30 years old in 1960. Sadly, on June 27, 2001, she left us due to kidney failure and diverticulitis at 71 in Chelsea, London, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. Has had his snout in a trough. Oh, well, I'll show him. I'll show everybody. Where's the phone? Oh, darling, Daisy, you know perfectly well where the telephone is here. Oh. Why are we coming? And I thought, my God, he was actually serious. So, of course, I really then started to flap. And I thought, I can't have Tyra. That great stuff. Frederick Beasley played the character Herbert Keane in the sitcom when he was 56 in 1960. Sadly, on March 22, 1975, he left us due to cancer at 70 years old in London, UK. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Pardon? <laughs> Wow! 
well, what? Ina Delahaye played the character Mrs. Sell Love in the sitcom when she was 54 years old in 1960. Sadly, on December 5, 1972, she left us due to an illness at 65 in East Sussex, UK. We're deeply saddened by her passing. Lordship, ah! And he's 91. <laughs> oh, what's that? What's that? Oh, it's probably Simon. Take a look, take a look. Yes, okay. Roy Hart played the character student in the sitcom when he was 24 in 1960. Sadly, on March 15, 2020, he left us from a short illness at 83 in Ipswich, Suffolk, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. I love touring, and I tell you why, because I've always been a great believer in that shows should be taken to the people rather than you trying to bring people to your show. And touring now is so successful. Leigh Madison played the character Marcia Hatton in the sitcom when she was 26 in 1960. Sadly, on January 8, 2009, she left us due to breast cancer at 74 in London, UK. We're deeply saddened by passing. The voice, the face. Well, you certainly remind me of Simon, hmm. and I'm sure he'll be back soon. Ah, oh, he better be, or he'll miss me. Haven't you since I don't know? Frank Pettigall played the character Captain Illove in the sitcom when he was 69 in 1960. Sadly, on February 17, 1966, he left us due to heart failure at 75 in London, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. One thing at a time. What are you doing at home, Lovie? Oh. Well, I understood that you were working overtime on this fine Saturday morning. Yes, yeah, so did I. Why aren't you at work, Daisy? Because of... Julie Stevens played the character self in the sitcom when she was 26 in 1962. See, at the age of 87, she's living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in Presswich, UK. Well, I suppose there's no harm in seeing the man. I'll arrange it for tomorrow morning. How's that? That's very sweet. No, I mean, how about tomorrow morning? Hmm? Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in our house? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.